Nearly one month after multiple tornadoes ripped through communities in our area, those recovery efforts are still ongoing. Thanks for joining us tonight at 10 everyone. I'm Rory Johnston. You know, last month's tornadoes were deadly. They impacted Clarksville, Hendersonville, Madison, really heartbreak all over Middle Tennessee and Kentucky. Now, we care how this story ends, which is why we wanted to share this plea tonight for help from a community group that says much needed donations dropped significantly after the holidays. Our Jason Lamb tonight with a look at how you can help. In a region still ravaged by last month's tornadoes, recovery is still very real. But at the Community Resource Center. This is our cleaning area and laundry. And then it goes really into the main hygiene items. Where items are ready to go for tornado survivors, leaders here say they're seeing a red flag. We are making that recovery as best as we can, but donations of hygiene and cleaning supplies are certainly much lower than they've ever been. Unlike other disasters Middle Tennessee has gone through, the Community Resource Center says while initial donations were strong, around the holidays, they dropped off even though the ongoing need is still there. I think part of that is just giving in general, like you've you've got kids or family members that you're buying gifts for, you maybe have already designated um, your end of year giving, and then to have a tornado happen so close to the end of the year, um, certainly I think that's impacted people's just financial status. The Resource Center says rather than donating used clothing or other used items they don't accept, there are easy ways for you to still make a difference. Cash is so important because we can buy the specific things that are being requested by case management and caseworkers for these families, but also our Amazon wish list is updated on a regular basis. So as those needs come in, they get added to the list. After all, with aftermath like this, neighbors here will still need help for a long time to come. Jason Lamb, News Channel 5.